Winter Court by Tom Lehman, published by Rio Grande Games. Finny Rob over here. Over there is Patrick. Welcome, Patrick. Welcome to the channel. We're playing in the lovely Dice Drop Games, greatest store in the South, probably, when it comes to games. Check them out, dicedropgames.com. We have played this game once off camera, and now we're going to play it again for your benefit. Tom, if you're watching this and we've messed something up, please let us know in the comments and we'll try to make a Klingon subtitle or something. Pat's going to be first player and he has five cards to start. I am second player and we'll be starting with these six cards. The way the game works is we're going to play until either someone controls all four of the royals, which are the purple tiles, or if the draw deck is ever empty, the game will immediately end and then we will score however many we control. All of these up to here are worth one point. This is worth two, three, four, and five. You'll see how it works. Basically, you play one card to bring it to your side and it's kind of a tug of war. Here, here, back to him. These cards have special powers. These do not. Basically on your turn, you can either play, which means you play one, usually one card. Sometimes you'll get to play more. Uh, and then you get to draw if you want, or you don't have to draw. So sort of like Lost Cities, you can hold back the end of the game because that is one of the ways it triggers. The other thing you can do on your turn is pass. When you pass, you must draw a card. But if you'd like, you can draw two cards, look at them, discard one and keep the other. I think that about covers it. Mm -hmm. Pat, you're up. All right. Fool is good to me. So I will continue that. At any point on his turn, he can use that when he plays, and the Fool basically lets you play a lower value to take it. So you'll see how these work. I'm going to start strong here and pull good. the consort to me. Mm -hmm. These that have two colors on them, they can take either of those types of cards. The ones with the single colors, those are the suits that must be played to them unless you can break the rule somehow by using special powers like the lover uh, or the knight. Go ahead and draw a card. Right, so you don't have to draw a card when you play, but you can. I will bring the lover over. I'll bring the lover right back. So that's discarded. Are there discards over there? All right. Uh, and I'm going to bring the matchmaker over. Oh, I forgot to draw a card at the end of All my right. turn. I'm going to grab the wizard. The wizard lets you play a second play on your turn, so you can get to basically play cards twice. The matchmaker, it allows you to play one card of each of the types if something takes multiples. And once you use a power, you put it back in the middle, it becomes neutral, but you leave the card there. And I'm gonna draw a card. All right. Let me go ahead, play that out there. That's strong, that's a strong play. I'm gonna play this to the sage. Take it here, okay. and I'll draw a card. There's no hand limit. All right, um, I'm just gonna play this out to the steward. Mm. I don't like that at all. So I'm gonna put that right back. Mm -hmm. Play four there. All right. Draw a card. The sage lets you look through the discard pile, but there's nothing good in there yet. <laughs> I know that. <laughs> I'll pull the charlatan to my side. The charlatan lets you remove the card that's influencing something that's neutral. So, for instance, it could remove this because it's neutral. And that's all for now. Mm -hmm. I'm going to bring the steward over. All right. Gosh, you really want the steward, Pat. Mm 
bring the knight over. The knight allows you to play a blue card along with another card that influences something. And the lover lets you do the same with red cards when you have that. And I'm going to draw. Good. I'm going to use the steward's ability to grab two cards. All right. He's taking the steward and putting, returning it. The card still remains, and he gets to draw two cards. And that does not interfere with his ability to draw at the end of his turn. And you still haven't played yet. Nope. I'm going to, I'm going to burn this one. Burning a one for the princess. And That's I'm pretty gonna... She's a cheap date. Yeah. All right, let me, can I work some magic? Yeah, I'm gonna play, I'm gonna use the knight. I'm gonna play a three Ooh. along with a seven. So this comes back to the middle because mm -hmm. I don't like having the fool there. Now, mm -hmm. um, there's another rule that we haven't had happen yet, which is a one, two, or a three can be used to boost a play of, a, of the same color. Uh, here, Though now, because this was not a boost, this was my ability of the knight, both of these cards stay there, and effectively this is a card that's a 10. And I will draw at the end of my turn. Okay. I'm going to play a red six there. All right. I'll play a red nine to bring it right back. Thwarting you at every... Mm -hmm chance I get. That hum you hear in the background is air conditioning. Well, you know what? I will just play this. Take the wizard. Smart. I should have used that. I will draw a card. I'm going to play a 10 to take the princess. Okay. I'm going to play a 6 to grab that knight. All right, well, I have the sage. I'll put it back in the middle. Mm -hmm. And I'm going take to take something good. I'm going to take this nine back in my hand. Okay. And then I'm going to use this nine to take the knight back in the middle to throw ah. whatever it is that you were about to do that's going to be crazy. Gog. Um. And now I'm drawing. I might have forgotten to draw last turn, but it's legal for me not to draw. So. Mm -hmm. My bad. Got to remember to draw if you want to draw. This is what I'm playing with right now. Mm. All right. So I am going to play this. So you're beating your own card. Yep. But then I'll grab the steward. And the steward allows you to draw two cards. Yes. But you have to have it on your side at the beginning of your turn. I'm wishing I didn't play that 10. Okay. All right. Seems like a good opportunity to play the matchmaker. You gonna play the matchmaker right? I think so. You sure did. So that's gonna bring this over here. Oh, that stinks we'll for me. Discard that, grab a card. I'll snag the matchmaker. Mm -hmm. And I'll draw. All right. I'm going to use the steward to take two cards. And then I'm going to use this, which will let me add a red card. All right, so lover lets you add a red. Yep. And so I'm going to play this, bring that back. That's legal. I'm moving that. All right, again, if you get all four purples on your side, the game immediately ends and you win. All right, I'm going to use the matchmaker. 16 beats 13. Oof. Wow. That's power play. Power play. Nice. All right, well. That's what I'm left with. I am going to grab the fool. So since I boosted it, the two, the two is going to go away. It's right. going to remove yours. And I will grab a card. So that lets you play a number lower to win. Yep. I'm going to pass. Okay. And I get to I can draw two cards and keep one and discard one. So I'm keeping one and discarding one. Okay. You can always count how many cards are in the draw pile. And you can always look through the discard pile. 
think I'm going to burn the fool here. And I'm going to play an eight here to bring the princess back. All right, so. And I'll draw a card. Well, I don't have a lot to do. So I'm going to pass again. Wow. I'm going to draw two cards, look mm -hmm. at them. Keeping one. Uh, believe it or not, I'm going to take that fool again. Uh, wow. And I'll draw a card. I'm not sure there's much I can do to stop you here. You're on a roll. Well, like last time we played, I really had a difficult time getting that last royal, which let you come back and, and take the game. So Yeah, I only hope I can do the same. Yep. Yep. But for right now I'm gonna pass. Okay. And I'm going to draw two cards. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna keep one. I guess I'll keep this one. Okay. I'm going to count these. There are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten cards okay. remaining in the draw deck. That's good to know. Well, then, I guess it's time to Gosh. play that fool. And I'm going to play a six to bring this back. Wow. To eliminate those two. All right. Well, in light of that development, take it right back. I'm going to take it right back. Yeah. Okay. Uh, was that a six? Yep, it's a six. Yeah, I guess I'll go with a seven. All right. Oh, I can't see. I blame you. And I'll draw one. Yep. Don't have to draw, but I did. This is what All I'm drawing. Right. So. All right. I'm going to play Charlatan, which will take this back. That's smart. And I should have probably used a Charlatan. And I, I, I totally forgot that I had that. So well played, sir. Well played. Definitely gets tougher to play cards down on this end. Oh, OK. Yep, yep. Well, that was sort of ripe. See, this is what happened last game now. Okay. So. Well, if the game ended right now, you'd still win. Yeah, five yeah. five to four. Well, this is, this is what happened last time, though. I, I, we got to the end of the game here, and I couldn't play anything. So uh, it doesn't look like I can, so I'll pass. And take two cards. Look at one. Uh, uh, yep. Keep one, discard one. Keep one, discard one. So I'm going to keep that and discard that. All right, I'm going to do the same thing. Mm -hmm. I'm going to pass. Wow. Okay. Oh, but if you pass. Yep. All right, well, I'm going to pass, but I'm just going to take one card. Okay. Oh no, I don't know if it's if I don't know if it's good enough. Alrighty. Um I'm going to play that there, which will move this here. It's gonna right. get rid of my boost card. It's also gonna get rid of that seven right there. And I'll draw a card. Mm, that's that's a coffin coffin corner punt there. This is crazy. There's only uh, that one that's not in the center. Ugh. Yeah, it gets, it for those, gets difficult. For those watching, this is what I'm looking at here. <laughs> you got a lot of cards. Tell me, yeah, they, I got a lot of cards. They all add up to about 15. Oh, dear. Or 20, yeah, something can't like that. boost anything then. Uh, let's see here. Yeah, yeah. If it makes you feel any better, I've got a set of three or twos, a set of twos, so. Yeah, well, <laughs> I don't think there's any way for me to wrestle that yeah, yeah. seven back from you yeah. and get another thing. And the only other thing worth any points is that princess but yeah it's only two points yeah it's only two yeah. points i think i'm i think i'm done for so yep. what i'll do is i'm yep. gonna play a, a six and a three boost yep take that away and get, get the one point maker. i'll get one point i'm not gonna get shut out yeah. i'm not gonna get pickled and i will not draw All a card right. um i have no legal plays other than draw two, draw cards, two cards and win the game and the, the game, game imme immediately ends yep Pat controls the ruler, yep. 
for five points and nothing else, and I control the matchmaker. So I think I lost five to one. Much much different game than last time. It was much more uh, competitive. Yeah, uh, I, that's I'm, true. I I, uh, but, I dug that. What, your thoughts? Oh, I, I love this game. I'm a huge Tom Lehman fan, um, and uh, this feels like a Tom Lehman game to me. Pat um, approves. Just very thinky game in a little box. Um, you know, it's just uh, it's it kind of the game itself doesn't remind me of uh, Res Arcana, but. It's that same kind of just a lot of game in a, in a small box. You know, it doesn't, this doesn't have, you know, the, the levels that that does. But um, this, you know, for something that takes 10, 15 minutes to play, I love it. Yeah, to me, this feels like a Ryan Arkinitzia game. <laughs> it really does. There's, sure. there's so many, there's, yeah. there's battle lines mm-hmm. uh, that game is right is right in front of me mm-hmm. and the lost cities thing of of holding back like at the end i ran out of time mm-hmm. and you could accelerate the game and end it well, i like that maybe if we inserted an auction somewhere in there then it would truly feel like a random and Canizia paste a, theme, a, a, a different <laughs> theme on sure uh, it was absolutely a great job we, we both so. approve well done, Tom. Hope, hopefully we did it justice here. Sorry if you couldn't hear with the air conditioning in the background, but it gets hot down here. <laughs> Thank you for watching. That's Winter Court. Please like this video and subscribe to the channel.